on this episode of Toast Hunters. The Crafts team investigates a toaster geist, tormenting a family who just wants to eat their breakfast in peace. Can the Crafts team follow the crumb trail to the source of the family's suffering? Join them as they investigate the Butterknife Mansion in Cincinnati, Ohio. What the hell? All right. So, Mango, you ready for this one? Yep. There's a family that claims that there's the spirit of a piece of toast haunting them. Hmm. Yeah, it's amazing. Amazing. Sometimes they say they feel crumbs on their arms. Hmm. Wow. Yeah, phantom crumb feelings on their arms. Yeah. And sometimes they hear these crunching sounds, especially in the morning during breakfast time. Hmm. Yeah. That's weird. Um, and then they smell this burning odor at times. Yeah. Yeah. They get hungry. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Well, yeah. But get this. They get these really strong cravings for butter and jam. What? Really? Really. Oh my god. Are you ready for this one? This could yeah, be our, I think so. This could be the craziest one yet. <sighs> yep. Alright, let's, let's do, do it. This. Hi, I'm Peeves. Hey, I'm Mango. I'm Betty Butterknife. Nice to meet you, Betty Butterknife. So, here you hear you have a toaster geist. That's right. Well, let's cut to the chase. Sounds good to me. No crumbs, but just a throbbing carbuncle. What the hell? So she said to me, I need to cut back on my toast honey because she's going gluten free. And I said, <laughs> Hear what? I hear a crinkling sound, a crunching sound. Do you hear it? Nope. What the hell? So what we have here is an EBT, electric magnetic bread toaster. We're going to use it to try to communicate with the toast spirit. So Mr. Toast Spirit, if you're here, can you do something for us? Can you get us a couple lemon tarts? No, that's not it. Can you make the EBT or something? Anything. Hey, do you smell something burning? Yes. I do. Look, it's glowing. Whoa! Mr. Toast Spear, are you doing that? You hear that? Sounds like... What, what the, the hell? hell? So, we've had a lot of compelling evidence, as you know, but this one really takes the coffee cake, if you will. You better believe it. Just watch. Peeves! Peeves! Where are you, man? You know, I've had some really bad cravings. Like... Like orange marmalade level cravings. 
Okay. Maybe even French soldiers dipped in meal maple syrup. Oh god, it's driving me crazy. Peace! Peace! Oh, peace! What the hell? Peace! Seriously? You ate the toast spirit? Without any butter or jam? What the hell? What the hell? So as you can see, we found some really compelling evidence that you had a toaster guy from having in your home. But we took care of it. We sure did. Thank you so much, guys. I just don't know how much longer we could have dealt with it. The cravings was worth. Oh, I know. Now we can get back to cooking pancakes and regular sandwiches. Oh, the humanity. It's such a relief to know we have more options than toast 24 7. Glad we can help. Thank you. Thank you. You are so welcome. Mango, excellent investigation, brother. I feel like we've given that family their full culinary palates back. Yeah, they're in a better situation now. Can't argue with that. On to the next!